So this video might come as a little bit of a surprise. I've not given any hints about this apart from my previous video slightly. Um, but there is a new horse that is living in this stable and has been for the past week. Um, so if you haven't seen my previous video, then this might be very confusing to you. So I recommend watching that one first. But basically three months ago, we actually sold Smokey. Um, he's been gone like three, three and a half months now. And then a month and a half after he was gone, I started looking for my unicorn. Um, so, Charlie went on loan, we had a spare stable and of course I've been rehabbing Snip and basically for the last year I and mean, for the last five years I've basically been bringing on horses, rehabbing and just kind of not doing everything I wanted to do riding wise. So I've saved up all my pennies and I wanted to go out and find the horse of my dreams basically, the horse I could go and enjoy a little bit of everything on, that I could get jumping again, I can go out competing, I can do some eventing, I can do some dressage, I can do some show jumping, whatever I want to do, I could go out and do it. So for the last month and a half, me and my mum have been trawling the country looking for horses um, and we have seen a lot. So guys, it's time for you to meet Percy. Another grey, I know I said I wasn't going to get another grey, but I just found Percy and I absolutely fell in love with him. So we searched for Percy for quite a while, um, I actually had another horse vetted before him that sadly failed the vetting, but I genuinely think everything was meant to be and when I met this special boy I just knew he was right for me. So Purse is a 15-1 Connemara, he's full Connie. Um, I wanted something slightly bigger um, and sort of had a leg in each corner like an old fashioned stamp um, and I wanted something that had been there and done it and Percy is definitely that. So he's 13 years old and he's previously done BE90. So he knows the job when it comes to eventing and he's got quite a good eventing record. He's also done dressage up to elementary. Um, he's a very brave boy when it comes to his jumps, especially solids like cross country. He is just an absolute machine. No jump is too big for him on the cross country course. Um, he's a talented jumper, as you can see. Um, he needs a little bit more leg on for his show jumps, but that will come as we learn to press each other's buttons and what how to work as a partnership. Um, I think he's definitely a very talented boy on the flat and in jumping he's just got a really nice head on him and he just puts the biggest smile on my face when I ride him um, so I was looking for something that had evented before because I definitely want to have a go at that next season I've always said I want to event um, but we've just never like it's just never happened um, whereas with Purse I know he's been there done it before and he'll kind of hold my hand through the experience too um, he's a very honest boy he is sensitive like and he's definitely a Connie and that he's quite whizzy and forward um, but you know me I have a weakness that's what I like um, and that's what I enjoy and I just think as we get to know each other and the more we do we're just gonna go from strength to strength already in the week that I've had him I'm jumping solid fences bigger than I have in years and I'm having so much fun in fact tomorrow we are actually heading out to our very first competition just a week into owning him but I thought you know what jump in enjoy yourself and his previous owners did say the more he does the better he is so we're gonna start this winter competing as we mean to go on go out and have some fun so guys that is Percy let me know what you think 
talk to him in the comments. I absolutely adore him. And even just in this first week of getting to know him has just been incredible. Obviously, our partnership will grow and we'll be doing lots of more things. Um, I have lots of big plans for me and Purse. So, yeah, it's very, very exciting. And I can't wait to bring you all on the journey. So don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you all next week for another video. Bye, guys.